So I've had this dump truck for a little while now, and if you don't drive a dump truck or never have, which I didn't before this one, uh, you learn that there are some things that are a pain in the ass that you just have to deal with. <clears throat> well, I don't like dealing with shit. So what I did was, oh, you will see it from here. I installed a shaker that I had pulled off of an old concrete plant, uh, and I ran it. Let me show you. I ran it back here. I picked up a spare uh, uh, brake relay. I just picked up this rubber hose from Harbor Freight. It's like 20 bucks for half inch, like 50 feet of it. Uh, plumbed it into the, it doesn't look new, but it is new, uh, other rear brake relay, uh, just so it's got air. Uh, this is the control line for it. And then, oh yeah, that's leaking. I gotta weld that up. Long story short, I broke that fitting off and I'm trying to weld it back up because it leaks. Well, the whole cylinder leaks, but you know, band-aids on an axe wound. Anyway, uh, the control line goes up and since this, this thing doesn't, I think it was originally going to be an actual 18-wheeler tractor, but it's a, it's now a dump truck. So I put the output control from this to that green hose that went to the back. So now it'll shake all the dirt out of the back. So. But anyway. Oh man, it works. I had some limestone stuck in the corner up here, which is typical you know especially if they if they don't kind of easily drop it in there they just kind of <laughs> dump it it packs in the corners and you know i slam the tailgate and stuff but sometimes it's not enough but uh i try to tell them like yo don't be dropping stuff in here and tearing my truck up all this rust is holding it together <laughs> but uh yeah i think they're like uh 100 bucks or something like that plus you can install it yourself i did the uh just routed the hose down the side there goes to the relay and uh but this is from a uh houston houston something like houston relays or houston vibratory or something i don't know they have them all over alibaba and ebay so they're not that expensive anyway <laughs>